Hey everybody, we're at the Atlanta Expo Center South for the Atlanta Camping and RV Show. It, it's like jamming right now, mm -hmm. super busy. Mm -hmm. We're parked between two dualies <laughs> and not sure we can even get out of our vehicle. <laughs> we may have to climb out the back hatch, but we are determined to get inside. This is our first RV show yeah. that we've ever been to. Um, so we're looking forward to it. The good thing is, is it's an all indoor RV show, and which is good because it's gloomy outside today, it and it looks like it may rain. So mm -hmm. we're gonna go inside, and hopefully they have a bathroom because I have to go to the bathroom very badly because <laughs> I drank coffee all the way here. But we're gonna look at everything because we just like looking at stuff, and we're gonna bring you along so that you can see all the. It might be something new we don't know about. Maybe. But we'll bring you along so you can see all the cool stuff that we're about to see. Ready? Yeah. Let's do it. Like the back back. Yeah, like awesome. You can live here. Yeah. That's your seat.
we went to the RV show in Atlanta on Saturday and it my advice is if you're gonna go to an RV show go early because yes. we got there early and it was good for an hour or so and then started getting really crowded and couldn't really see everything that you wanted to see in the coaches because it was so crowded and busy and some of the coaches we didn't even go in because we would go in and there'd be like so many people in the coach you're just like mm, not gonna look at this one and uh it was cool to have some of the the vendors there and some of the demonstrations and things like that to see but some of the people there at those booths were rather pushy when it comes to selling but that's, that's what they do for a living so um this is more our speed so we decided i'd take the day off on monday and we had come out to uh, the dealers in macon georgia and check out the rvs out here which is more our speed we kind of get to go on our own and walk through the coaches and take our time and and see all the features and open all the cabinets and check all the stuff without the huge crowd that was our first rv show well we're definitely going to go back to rv shows just to see all the new stuff that they come out with what did you like about the show i liked a lot of things about the show you know it, the the variety of what we're looking for wasn't necessarily there right but they had a lot of cool stuff they did have a lot of cool stuff and we went and we looked at stuff that we're definitely not going to no, buy, yeah, just but we look. still looked at it because it's just cool to see. We went in to the new Airstreams, which were really cool. The mm -hmm. Winnebago's. We went in several of the Class A motor coaches, which are just ridiculously awesome. <laughs> we don't go in travel trailers as much just because we've kind of really, Pretty much know that's really ruled that much. out. And, mm -hmm. and I mean, we've ruled out Class A motor coaches and Class C's too, yeah. but it's just cool when you see on the outside and you're like, how do they even fit living space inside this thing I have mm -hmm. to see so sometimes your curiosity just gets you and you have to go inside and check it out we did see a really cool Columbus yeah. compass by Palomino I think I got all that right I had a really unique beautiful. floor plan that we hadn't mm -hmm. seen before so at the show I think that's that's where you get your cool unique stuff people bring stuff to shows specifically for the shows highlight for good stuff yeah so stuff that you wouldn't see so I think that's definitely one of the reasons to go to a show lots of cool yeah. products for yeah. RVs and not even just necessarily for RVs but just a lot of cool stuff so yeah you could use them in your home you yeah to be RV. so once it started getting crowded in the afternoon it was yeah. kind of too much for me and I don't do big crowds very well so we had to get out of there but it was fun so we didn't get a lot of footage at the show because it's just you're basically like filming a bunch of people in a in a coach so you can't really see the coach but it was fun i'm looking forward to going to another one